I broke the rules and paid the price. Now I'm broke. What's up guys? Welcome to Douglas on Trading. I'm not really broke, however, I did blow my 1UP Trader account. The last video I made, I was telling you basically how great of a job I was doing. I had killed the uh, challenge, I crushed the challenge. Uh, I had 14, well, I had 13 positive um, day trading uh, days in a row, so I made money for 13 days in a row um, to earn the funded account from 1UP Trader. And then in a matter of about one week, I blew it all. Hooray for me. So what happened basically is uh, once I got funded, um, the first two days went really well. And then there was a bad omen, and this is one of the rules that I shouldn't break. I woke up, uh, I think it was on a Thursday, and I thought, I don't feel like trading today. Something's off. I feel weird. I don't want to trade. And I said, that's silly, you love to trade. And so I sat down and I traded and I lost a whole lot of money. And I broke multiple rules that day. So not only did I ignore the feeling that I had in the morning uh, that my mind was off, so that's a big thing. You gotta have your mind right before you trade. So I ignored that completely. And then uh, I proved that my mind was off by making a bad trade for the first trade. And then I thought, well, Maybe I should just walk away, live to trade another day. That's usually my motto, live to trade another day. And I said, no, uh, you can make this up. I mean, this classic, classic trading error, classic mental breakdown. And then so I took another trade and that one was bad too. And I was like, well, I can make that all up in one trade too. And another trade. And then before you know it, I was down over my daily loss limit when I, um, made for myself daily loss limit. I wanted to lose no more than about $500, $600 in a day. I lost about $1,000 in one day. And then the next day, I did it all over again. And that was pretty much it for my account. I had a few bucks left. It wasn't much to survive on. It was basically like if you go a few ticks in the wrong direction, you're going to bust your trade. So it was epic. I mean, I've never blown uh, an account in that fashion that quickly. And uh, I mean, there was a few signs uh, when I went back and looked at my numbers for the trading challenge to earn the funded account. My losses were bigger than my wins, but I didn't think much about it because I had so few losses. Um, but that was a small sign that maybe this, you know, once the gravy train of the, the hot hand ended, you know, once the market changed a little bit or once... Uh, sometimes you just go on a hot streak. Once that streak ended, I was going to be in trouble because the losses were bigger than the wins. So now uh, what I'm going to do is work on that. Basically, I've got to work on my targets. I need to make trading less stressful. I need to make it so um, it's okay to lose, that it doesn't throw you off because you know that when you win, you win more than when you lose. It's trading 101. But it's a lot harder to do, especially when you've got real money going, um, holding on to those winners, cutting losses tight. I mean, it's an old cliche saying, and it's just so hard to do mentally. But that's what I'm working on now. And uh, and then I've got an announcement in the next video because uh, I'm going to go for funding again. So stay tuned for the next video because there is a special deal. It's the deal of a lifetime for anybody that wants to try to get funded and it only lasts till the end of September. So watch that video and happy trading.